Luke 2 Now it came to pass, in those days, that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus, that all the world should be registered. This census first took place when Quirinius was governor of Syria. And all went to register themselves, every one to his own city. And Joseph also went from Galilee out of the city of Nazareth into Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and family of David, to enroll himself with Mary, who was engaged to him, being great with child. And it came to pass, while they were there, the time came that she should give birth. And she brought forth her firstborn son, and she wrapped him in cloths, and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. And there were shepherds in the same region staying in the field, and keeping watch at night over their flock. And an angel of the Lord stood by them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were terrified. And the angel said to them, Be not afraid, for I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For there is born to you this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign to you. You shall find a baby wrapped in birth clothes and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a crowd of the heavenly host praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among those in whom he is well pleased. And it came to pass, when the angels went away from them into heaven, the shepherds said to each other, Let us now go to Bethlehem, and see this thing that has come to pass, which the Lord has made known to us. And they went with haste, and found Mary and Joseph, and the baby lying in the manger. And when they saw it, they told people about the same which was spoken to them about this child. And all that heard it wondered at the things which were spoken to them by the shepherds. And Mary treasured up all these sayings, pondering them in her heart. And the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard and seen, just as it had been spoken to them. And after eight days, when he was circumcised, his name was called Jesus, which name was given by the angel before he was conceived in the womb.